Hello friends, today I am going to show and explain you different technique to analyze DNS records. There are several common DNS records you can see listed below. In penetration test engagement, the customer may ask you to find all of the host and IP address available for their domain. The only information you have is the organization domain name. In that case, we look at several common tools that can help you. So we discuss that tools in this video. So before we start, we need to find organization domain name. We use Whois. It's a protocol for searching internet registration database for registered domain name, IP, and autonomous system. So Whois, and we use Google in that case. You can see here list of domain names and registration detail. After we get DNS server information, the next step is to find out IP address of host name. So we need to use host command line tool to look up IP address of a host from DNS server. So host and type 12 and you can see here, look at the IP address. We find IPv4 and IPv6 address here. By default, the host command will look for the A, AAA and MX record for a domain. To query for any record, just give the dash A option and press enter. And you can see here. The host tool can also be used to do DNS zone transfer. With this mechanism, we can collect information about the available host name in domain. Now move to next dig. You can also use dig command to do DNS interrogation. The advantage of dig compared to host are its flexibility and clarity of output. So let's use dig to integrate google.com. So dig and see here. It's a query session and answer sessions without giving any option besides the domain name. The dig command will only return the A records of domain. To request for any other DNS records, type any. So we just type any. So we just type any. And here. From the result we can see that the dig output now return the DNS record from SOA, NS, A, N, 4 times A. To do zone transfer, we use dig. We must set authoritative DNS server for the domain and set AXFR as a type. Now we move to next DNS NM. To collect information from DNS server, we can utilize DNS NM. The DNS information that can be gathered is as follow: the host IP address, the DNS server of a domain, the MX record of a domain. The purpose of different tool to get same information is we get be more confident with the information. DNS NM have following features. Get additional names and subdomain utilizing Google search engine. Find out subdomain name by brute force the name from the text file. The DNS NM tool include in Kali comes with DNS.txt dictionary. The dictionary contain around 1480 subdomains name and dns-big.txt file which contain around 2,66,930 subdomain name. So next feature is carry out who is query on C class domain network range and calculate its network range. Carry out reverse lookup on network range. Use threads to pro proceed different queries. Now let's use DNS NM tool. DNS NM and type www.google.com and you can see here for use brute forcing features just type DNS NM dash F and your dictionary path DNS text file and press enter. So that is part one. We cover more cool tools in next video. Please subscribe and thanks for watching this video. Thank you so much.